I wanted to talk about the coal-fired power plants in northwestern New Mexico for just a minute. Um, it's clear that these these are problematic. Um, we can't be using coal anymore, yet those people and communities rely upon those jobs. There's so much disagreement right now over abandoning or repurposing those coal-fired power plants, and I'm curious why any company would want to step into that. Um, you know, what are your plans for these coal-fired power plants? I'll answer from, from p and m and and then I think that will help you understand why Avangrid um, was willing to work with us. You know, the governor has her landmark Energy Transition Act, which calls for us to be able to securitize the plants in San Juan and shut those down. We already shut two units down, so the next two get shut down um, next summer. And that allowed for us to um, basically pay off the balance of the, the debt on those plants at a very low cost, and we'll pass those savings on to customers, and the shareholders forego any, any profit that they would have been able to make. But one of the, to me, the, the real neat thing about that legislation is the money that's in there to help train and help develop that economy, because you just can't shut down a coal plant and say, have a nice day, get a job. So it allows us to train workers, to help the Four Corners area do economic development. That is the first and only legislation of its kind um, in our country. And I think Ibadrola and Avangrid saw that and saw how we worked as a state to make sure we had a just transition. Then you look at the Four Corners power plant. We had been working on an early exit from that for some time. And Avangrid wanted to make sure that we did have a contract to get out of it and file uh, for the Commission for Abandonment, which they just gave us approval for. We need to make a, a contract change with um, NTEC. And there has been some criticism that, well, PNM, you're getting out of it, but it's going to uh, NTEC, which is the Navajo Transitional Energy Company. But that's what they wanted now. They need a glide path to get out of fossil filed energy, not a cliff. And so we're shutting the, the four units of San Juan will have been shut down in a pretty short period of time. Two units at Four Corners have already been shut down. Excuse me, three units at Four Corners have already been shut down. So this will allow them a, a just, because there's, there's funds for economic development in there, a just and a more gradual transition out of coal. Um, their economy was devastated also by the fact that the Navajo generating station shut down um, very suddenly. And that was a terrible polluter. It had no controls on it. Um, Four Corners does have some controls on it. So it's a compromise to make sure the environment is taken care of, but also uh, the Navajos are taken care of. And Pedro, what is the company's plans for these moving forward? I, I think as Pat mentioned, you know, we, we love that they were exiting coal. I think as Ibedrola, you know, we don't have any coal asset in operation. You know, we had a couple of, you know, coal facilities not in operation for a long time. We shut them down. We also shut them down in the UK. So we don't have any coal assets in operation. We're very happy about that. I think in last week in the COP26, my chairman actually, you know, proposed to shut down all the coal facilities in the world, you know, and put a deadline, you know, to all of them, you know, to stop, you know, having those assets in operation. And I think in this case, I think the, you know, as, as Pat mentioned, you know, they already, you know, ex, you know, shut down San Juan. I think, you know, they have agreed and they have been approved now the sale of their financial stake in, 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 in Four Corners. They were not the operators. They were not the controlling entity. And that's why I think, you know, there is a path now, as she says, you know, way out of the power plant. We all want things to happen faster. And if Iberdola can help in any way, we will. But I think, you know, New Mexico, compared to many other places, you really have now a path ahead of you. I think you're, you're very lucky about that because that's not the case in many other places. Mm 